Where, where I grew up, um, I've often talked about growing up on this Christmas tree farm, surrounded by a big dairy farm, but also surrounded by woods. And uh, I always heard stories about somebody, sort of a legendary figure, called the Leather Man. And the Leather Man, back during the Revolutionary War period, uh, was a kind of hermit. And he would roam around in the woods, probably shooting deer and uh, curing, tanning the leather. And he eked out some sort of paltry existence selling his, his leather. So I mentioned that in the poem. <coughs> the Bottle Dump. We leaned under gold oak leaves that cold November, saying nothing as wind numbed hands and the sky whitened. I watched you rake bed springs and cans, slip the pitchfork into the dumps of cretions, plate shards, clamshells, char. Probing for the familiar click of buried glass, I struck something softer than stone, white as an oak root center. Was it the skull of the leather man haunting these woods since the revolution? You pulled roots from a jaw stained by mulch. At home, we scrubbed and buffed them all, the round-lipped ones, the green pommel-marked ones, the ones labeled Dr. Applebaum's Florida waters. Propped on sills, they split the sun in colors. At night, guarded our sleep against the moon's intrusions, their trapped spirits trembling to break from glass.